Good morning everybody, Johnny here from One Max Dream and welcome back to the final day of this Norwegian Fjords cruise. It's a sad moment. However, we have a full day at sea today, so there's going to cram as much of it in as we can possibly do uh, and see as much of the Disney magic as possible. Uh, this morning we have a very busy morning. We have a royal gathering meeting the princesses. We have Disney at Sea with D23, which is going to be really, really good uh, over in the Brina Vista Theatre. So I may be able to share some things that come from that. We have Jack Jack's Diaper Dash. We've never seen. I've never seen a diaper dash so far, so we're probably going to head and have a look at that. There is a character dance party in the atrium, which I really would like to see, to see who comes to that. We're going to have a tour of the Disney Magic. Um, I may try to join one from where we started off at the beginning of the cruise. Potentially we'll be doing, doing some Star Wars trivia. Then we hope to do some bingo meet some characters, Daisy's out this afternoon, Mickey Mouse is out this afternoon, uh, Donald's out this afternoon, which we're going to try to meet, all this, grabbing it in, gonna try to, we have Disney Dreams and Enchanted Classic this evening, we have At The Movies with Will over in Keys in the Piano Lounge this evening, we have Dinner at Animator's Palette, we're going to try and see Soul Duo in the Atrium, and then at 10.15 this evening we have Till We Meet Again, a show in the Atrium. That's today's plan, we have lots to do, so let's get to it, and I'll stop talking. And oh, what a beautiful morning at sea. We have some blue skies, the sun is breaking through, and the sea is buttermilk pond. And that's what we like to see on a sea day. We don't want waves, we don't need them today. Blue skies, please, and just a nice calm waters for our final sailing into Dover. The atrium is a hive of activity this morning, so we have Cinderella meeting at the Princess Meet and Greet, we have Rapunzel. Tiana and Mulan and then we also have Daisy over here in her princess outfit everyone's lining up to meet them this morning so first job this morning is to do some shopping and we're gonna head first of all I think into Mickey's main sale to see if there's any few bits that we would like to buy Good morning, Princess Daisy. How are you? You look incredible. I love your outfit. Thank you for letting me take a photo. I'll let you go because I know you're super busy. Thank you very much. See you later. Thank you. Now wave. <laughs> oh, and we're back. Um, we. I've been busy. Well, to be fair, so have you. Um, we've just come into Cabanas, as you can see behind, while we get some lunch. Uh, we had a beautiful curry today, which was very, very nice. Uh, so let's give a bit of an update. D23, let's see. It's really, really good, actually. We got to see some uh, exclusive trailers of the new Avatar film coming out. We got to see some new trailers of some new series coming to Disney+, Plus, including Andor. Uh, we got to see Hocus Pocus 2 uh, and different things like that. They spoke about The Wish. We got to see some bits about The Wish. Uh, from the Maiden Voyages, uh, they talked about some of the Christmas things that's coming to the theme parks as far as the shows, Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. Uh, they showed some of the new, new artwork released at uh, in New Orleans at one of the community fairs, which is for the new renovation and reimagining of Splash Mountain for Tiana's Bayou Adventure which is really really good and then they showed a little bit about the new uh, village that they're building over in the Coachella Valley in uh, California and the community that they're building there and some of the information regarding that it was really really interesting actually uh, some of the trailers look really really good uh, the artwork for Indi the new Indiana Jones film looks really good some of the new animation things that come next year and or the series the Star Wars series looks really good uh, Mandalorians are coming back and some of the Marvel stuff as well that's coming looks really really interesting so it was well worth it it's on your sale and head over there obviously the main D23 I think is at the end of this month um, so more will come out but it was really really good and really interesting actually uh, you had a wander round, you sat in 
promenade lounge and then we saw the Jack Jack's diaper dash now for obvious reasons we didn't actually film the actual dash for the privacy of the babies involved they want to keep their the identity is anonymous, however I did fill some of the crowds, so I'll put that in now because I've never seen so many crowds on the ship in the atrium. <laughs> so congratulations to the winning baby and your Mickey medallion. And what you think? I think someone from Manchester, so always a winner. Uh, so we're just going to have some dessert and then there is a character disco, I believe. A character dance party at 1.30, which we're not going to dance, but we will um, we will attend and just have a look to see what characters are at. Um, I did say that I was going to the Royal Gathering this morning. I did look and I chickened out. You know I'm not very good at greeting and talking to characters with faces. That sounds stupid, but yeah, so if you want to go, you go, but I chickened out. We'll have some lunch. Now lunch is done and the sun is out, so let's explore deck 9 and 10 here on the Disney Magic with a, a little nostalgic walk round. Let's go. For this cruise, I googled and watched a few videos on like what to pack on a Norwegian Fjord cruise, and everyone said pack for layers and pack for the rain because it always rains and it's quite cold. It's neither raining, it's neither cold. Instead, it's beautiful sun and heat wave weather, and I've got skinny jeans on. So when you pack for your next Norwegian adventure, stick a pair of shorts in as well, because you never know. But, as my mum just said, I would rather have not packed the shorts and get this weather than to have packed the shorts and not got this weather. So, I will suffer with the, uh, the jeans in the heat. Okay, okay, it is time for the Disney dance party in the atrium. Uh, so, I don't think I'll be dancing, but we'll check out what's going on anyway, because uh, it's the first time I've seen one, so let's have a look. Oh, that dance party is absolutely bouncing. It is so cool that they do that. The kids are having a ball and I am loving the fact that the characters are out there on the dance floor just having just as much of a good time. And so are the cast members, to be fair. They're absolutely loving it. I think we're going to head for a drink in Keys now, though. No, we're not. We're going to Signals. Uh, because we're on as holidays, as Jane MacDonald would say. And when you're on your holidays, you can have a break. Quit bevy, so we're gonna hit for a drinking keys while this weather is stupendously beautiful. Good evening everybody, some time has passed and it is the evening time. We're having our final glass of bubbly on board, so cheers to one and all that have watched this series. To your Disney health. Uh, this evening we are going to the theatre. Uh, we have Disney Dreams and Enchanted Classic, which I love. We're back in Animator's Palette for our final night, which I love. We're going to go to Keys and we're going to round off the evening and we'll probably do a little bit of a talk of what we've loved and what we've not, if we get chance. 
that may not happen that might be a separate vlog we'll see about that but for now let's head to the theater <laughs> Here we are for the final time in the Walt Disney Theatre. It's quite emotional to be in here for the last night and for my favourite show, Disney Dreams, an enchanted classic. We are in the back seat of the theatre for the last day. We get a great view and I'm really, really looking forward to this show, so I'll let you know how it goes. I shall fill you in on the show, but we're back in Animator's Palette this evening. It is animation night, so if I just move my phone, we're drawing characters tonight and then they will come alive. So, many of this evening will go through. We have some appetizers, so I'll probably have the chicken satay. There are smoked salmon or a tomato caprice. We have a soups and salads. And then. We've got main courses, we have shrimp, we have lamb, we have beef wellington, which I may have. We have salmon, chicken, the usual. We've got the menus that are always on there. And then finally we've got celebration cake, an amaretto cheesecake, a chocolate decadence, and a very cherry chocolate sundae. There we are. Okay, here we are. Here is my monstrosity. It's supposed to be the Union Jack. It's turned out not, and I don't know why he's got so dark eyes. He looks like me when I finished a cruise. And then if you uh, hold yours up, Mum. <laughs> uh, it's an interesting look. Okay, after a quick dash out of uh, Animator's Palette, we're heading to the Till We Meet Again show. I'll fill you in on everything else once we get there, but we'll just get a spot on deck five for this little show. Hey, welcome back to the beautiful Wally Eating Magic of the Disney Magic. How are you all doing this evening? Fantastic, fantastic. Well, it's so lovely to see you all. And enjoy this amazing Norwegian show of cruise over the last seven days. And you enjoy it all with the rest of your family and friends right here in the beautiful city magic. But I just wanted to say, we wanted to say goodbye one last time. We wanted to bring back some of our very special friends. So let me ask you, would you like to see them? And with that, our cruise has come to an end. Um, it feels like we've been on board for quite some time. However, in reality, it's also gone quite quick. I think when you're on an itinerary like this that's 
every day you're going tomorrow tomorrow we're in such a place it seems to fly by but what a cruise this has been from being back on the magic to bringing my mum who's there uh, thoroughly enjoyed it to visiting Norway and who and her stunning beauty the fjords are probably the one cruise I think everybody should 100% do to seeing the northern lights to meeting the characters to formal nights to new shows to meeting new people and uh, making new friends and, and meeting old friends as well so Nick and Steph who I met on the last cruise I'll see you again next year on the wish to Lindsay and Dennis who has have accompanied us each evening in Keys uh, thank you for your stories and for my gift it's greatly appreciated and yeah it's been a fun cruise I've loved doing a longer itinerary I can't wait to be back on Disney Cruise Line. I'm not ready to quite get off yet. Um, that's it from another Disney series. Uh, I will be back with a Christmas series at some point in December. I think it will be pretty sort of around the 10th to 12th of December. As Sunday around that date where they'll come out where I will be in Disney for a Christmas extravaganza. I've got seven days to hit as much of the Christmas Disney as I possibly can, including Mickey's Very Merry Christmas Party. And then I will be back in Florida at the end of Jan next year to start another Disney cruise where I will be doing a cruise on the wish. And then I've got the dream book for next year and who knows where I will end up. But either way, I'm looking forward to getting to Disney at Christmas. I'm going to miss being in the Disney bubble. And yeah, it's been an incredible cruise. Um, if you haven't done so already, uh, check out my Instagram. I'll link it down below. There's lots of stories and lots of other bits that potentially didn't hit the, the vlogs. But overall, I'm going to leave it there. I need to pack. <laughs> and it's currently 12 o'clock. I need to pack. I've just done the envelopes and surveys and all that jazz so uh, I will see you in December I will leave you with the usual montage and all I'm going to say for the final time this series is like this video if you enjoyed it subscribe to see more and uh, yet again I shall see you real soon goodbye five hours 300 miles a lot of Disney tunes that is the Disney magic right there hey thank you thank you we're on board.
been a long two days. <laughs>